Alright, welcome back ladies and gentlemen to the Chupacabra Tutorials channel. I'm your host Larry and today we're going to be talking about how to manually add games to Steam. This includes how to redeem Steam keys inside of Steam that you got from another website like maybe Humble Bundle or maybe your friend just sent you one as a birthday gift because they had a spare. And you can also add some of the other software and games on your computer to your Steam library which allows you to use the Steam overlay to do things like take screenshots, to chat with your friends, all of those various things can then be utilized. And all you have to do is open up Steam, log in, and go to your library page where you download everything and update stuff and all of that, and you're looking for this button in the lower left-hand side of the screen called Add a Game. When you click on this, you have a couple of options. You can browse the Steam store for games, which is just regular browsing and buying. You can activate a product on Steam. This is where you redeem your key or your code, or you can add a non-Steam game. If you've got a Steam code, you can go ahead and plunk it in here. Like I've got one that I was sent for a game I need to review. And then if you keep going next, it'll say this is the app Killer Chambers, and you can say finish and we'll go ahead and prompt you to install it, which I will do. It'll be all fancy, hunky-dory, and all of that jazz. Although I will go ahead and pause that, because I've got a bunch of stuff that needs to update, and I don't want to hork my internet right now. Uh, the other thing you can do is add a non-Steam game. And what this is going to do is it's going to scan your computer for every last piece of software, so that if you see something in here that you'd like to run on Steam, you can select it, or multiple things, and then it'll show up in the sidebar list here. Although, I'll be honest, I haven't done this in a little while, so why don't we add... Let's add, like, Minecraft to this list, just for, just for kicks. Add selected programs. And now Minecraft shows up right here. However, this won't show you anything else on this page because this is a game that is not normally in your profile on Steam because Minecraft, the way that they were set up and run, they've never been able to qualify to be on the Steam storefront. So that's how you do all that stuff. And I believe to remove this, you can delete the shortcut out of your Steam library since it's not actually controlled by Steam, and then it's gone. So that's how you control adding games to Steam, redeeming codes, and so on and so forth. I hope you found this useful. And until next time, I've been your host, Larry. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you next time. Bye, everybody, and have a good one.